Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps. Today I'm going to share with you one of the most common problem with PC computer, the Windows computer. You cannot update the Windows and uh, in other words, window update failures and you don't know how to fix it. And I'm going to share with you in Easy Steps. So whenever you try to update the window update, and uh, it just give you error you cannot update it because uh, there are so many errors and uh, you try to google it and uh, there are so many answers to your questions but uh, still you're not getting through so if you follow my instructions in no time you will be able to fix the problem so i'm going to share with you let's get started I'm going to open a notepad, I'm going to write down the information and what basically you need to do on your PC once you watch my video, you need to go open your command prompt and you need to write down each information which I'm going to give it to you, then you have to hit enter. Once you are done, you will be able to update your windows. So let's get started. I'm going to open a new test document and I'm going to open it and I will make this one small so you can uh, see it in the window as I have opened uh, the new text document and uh, I'm going to open the command prompt this is what you're going to see once you're going to open your command prompt all the information I'm going to type it here you need to do it right here first of all I'm going to copy paste here so you know I can make it a little bigger the font size so it will appear better so you don't miss anything I'll make it bold so it will more clear so this is what you're gonna see and once you write down this one you're going to hit enter and this information should go on the command prompt then after that you're going to write down this then hit enter again after this we're going to write down this one and let me make this a lot so this is a one line anything I'm writing on the notepad the same information I'm going to put under my info so you can copy and paste uh, into your command prompt and each line once you're done with it you're going to hit enter we're going to do the last one and we're going to say hit enter and after this you're going to reboot so majority of the people who are having a problem they cannot update uh, their uh, windows they will able to fix this issue and supposedly it's still giving you a problem you're still having some issues it can be anything it can be virus or maybe i don't know uh, what could be the reason there are millions of reasons but i wanted to make your life easier so if you just follow the instructions and you should be able to fix your problems and uh, this will be the first step and uh, majority of the people should have this uh, issue resolved by this and if it doesn't happen then what do you need to do the same scenario you're going to open the command prompt again once you open the command prompt you're going to write down this exact information and you're going to hit enter once you do that then you're going to do the second in this uh, case we're going to change all the DLL files in case sometime DLL file get corrupted maybe it's a virus or any other scenario uh, can cause a problem if you install some program you uninstall it and uh, you deleted some file which was shared and uh, it caused a problem with the DLL file and that causes a big issue uh, when you're going to update your windows and it will give you error and the last one you need to do and 
all these three lines one you're going to copy and paste up here on command prompt you're going to hit enter the second one you're going to do the same thing the third one you're going to do the same thing each time you enter information you hit enter once all of this one done then you the last step we're going to reboot again once you reboot it it will 100% fix your issue again this information I'm going to add in the, my info so you can copy and paste you don't have to worry where is the spacing like here space here spacing so you don't have to worry if you miss it or a capital letter is missed so I hope you will like this tutorial how to fix your window update issue and if you do like this one make sure to like and subscribe and share and I'm going to see you soon with easy steps thank you very much you have a great day bye bye